I'm going to show you how to download the OneTalk app on your mobile device. I'm using an iPhone, um, so I will go to the App Store. If you're using an Android device, you'd go to the Google Play Store. And in the search, you're going to type out OneTalk, all one word. And in there, I've already downloaded it, but it would be Verizon OneTalk. You will download it. Like I said, I've downloaded it already. And hit open. This is what the home screen is going to look like. Welcome to OneTalk. Hit get started. You have to go through and allow all of these permissions. Basically, it's asking to use your microphone, um, camera contacts, and notifications. Hit continue. Now you'll enter your OneTalk phone number. This is not your cell phone number. This is your OneTalk phone number. It is your desk phone number if you have one. And if you just have a mobile app, it is that number. We'll enter that. You can name it whatever you'd like. Whatever name you put here is going to come through in an email to the administrator or yourself giving you the PIN code. Request PIN. It is going to come to whatever email is loaded into the portal attached to that number. It is a six digit PIN code. Hit activate. This is where you'll enter your information. Some of this is optional. Then hit done. You are now in the app. There are several calling options, two to be exact, with the app. I'm just going to click through next. The one you are going to want to pick is One Talk Call Through. You're going to select the call through option. And once you're in, you can toggle between the two, but start with call through. Go next. Here's where you're going to enter your cell phone number. So this is not your one talk number, this is your cell phone number. Validate. Done. And as you can see, I'm in. Now you can go through calls, messages, you can set up meetings if you're a Blue Jean licensed user contacts, voicemail. One of the features I'm going to show you, if you click up here in the upper left to that little hamburger menu, you're going to see a couple different things. This right hand arrow is how you do call forwarding. So if say I was going to be out of the office or if I was on vacation and I wanted to forward all my calls, I would enter the number that I want all my calls to go to. It would skip your device and it would skip your desk phone if you have one. Hit confirm. Call forwarding's on. If I want to turn it off, simply push that button. Now it's off. It's going to come back to your, to your app. If you don't want to be disturbed for a brief period of time or a long period of time, depending on what you're doing, click that middle button. Now you're on do not disturb. It will not ring your device at this point. So you're going to want to turn that back on when you're ready to take calls. And then this third little icon is voicemail. So if I have any voicemails, Again, if you're a desk phone user on your desk phone, you can check them from here. If you're an app only user, they will live here. You'll push that and it'll bring you to your voicemail. If you would like to make calls, simply push the keypad and then you can start dialing. That is the OneTalk app.